Speaking of Mila, Zilli to arrive last night. Great Zeph and Zillia should arrive by Monday. Oh, sick, dude. Sick. Assuming you're going to play Zillia first because of the whole Bazanga skit story you told me about. Well, obviously you wouldn't play Zillia 2 first, but uh, assuming you're going to play Zillia first. Honestly, I'm obviously going to say Grace is F because Grace is F. I love Grace is F, but honestly, Zillia is great. They're both really good, so if I'm honestly down for Zillia. Zillia is still a really good Tales of game. I love Zillia. Yearly, I just platinum Zillia. Hey, it's Major General Karin Travers. Keep your voice down, you idiot. Private Yuito Sumeragi. <sighs> I heard you were getting chased around by the crows. Yes, sir. They're just like mosquitoes in the winter. Powerless, but annoying. So use them instead. It's easier to climb the ranks with some notoriety. You'll also learn a thing or two under Seto's leadership. Anyway, keep at it. I expect big things from you. Lucky you. Major General Karin apparently has had an eye on your talent since you were still a cadet. What? Really? Yes. A Septentrion first class thinks you're promising. Don't let him down. Major General Karin's faith in me. It doesn't seem to be because of my brother. He doesn't seem the type. Oh, crap. I can't stop myself from smiling. Anyway, could you go report to Wataru? I'm going to go check on Kagero. Uh, why? It seems like he stayed behind in Kikuchiba, and I'm a little concerned. Oh yes, and Nagi, you entered a prohibited area back there. Write and submit an incident report immediately. Oh. All right then. Wow, a Septentrion like Kara knows you. He must really see something in you. It's so amazing that you managed to get his attention. <laughs> yeah, but I'm a volunteer soldier. You're finally here. I got so tired of waiting for you that I dragged myself out. Hurry up and give me your mission report to put on record. I want to get this over with so I can go play some games. Yo, what kind of games he got? Reinforcement request received from Kodama Platoons, Arashi Spring. Location is Mizu Hagawa, New City Developmental District. It's a distress signal. We have to go. Already? We just got back. I'm coming too. You were told to write up an incident report, Nagi. But Yuito is going... Can Sugumi come? Hanabi, please go see Wataru for me. And could you help Nagi write his report? I'll head over to Mizuhagawa. What? what? Yuito, be careful. It must be bad if Arashi is asking for help. You're backing me up. I'm counting on you. Please let Sugumi come with me. Be careful, Yuito. Yeah, sorry about everything. Like Nagi. Seriously, make it back in one piece, alright? I plan to. The game's on hold for now, I'll guide you perfectly, so leave it to me. No, I don't mind helping you with your report, Yuito. Go check on the remaining amount of medical supplies. Damn, if only I didn't have to do this report. Now, no, I no, I know I'm to blame. Yeah, you, you're totally to blame. You're, you're cool and all, but yeah, you're to blame. Sorry, not sorry. 566th member, my goodness. One of this year's last newest recruits don't get a big head from all the attention. Prove to me you belong here. It'll be easy for an up, up and coming rookie like you. Go we'll get the data I tell you to. I'll give you a reward if you bring it back. Ooh, this is a quest. We got some side quests here. I'm down. Huh, you're eager. There are a bunch of others there, so don't do your best. Oh, begin quest. Don't get cocky. Sure. Would you like to make this quest active? The current active quest will be- Okay, yeah, why not? How does one- Oh, you can switch between them. Okay, that's the main quest. We do- I wanna do that side quest then. You can report the quest- Oh, I, I did it already? Was it just like a fetch quest I needed materials for? You gonna tell me you couldn't do it? I won't take no for an answer. Hurry and get the date. Never mind, no. You can accept quests. There are side quests in this game. That's awesome. I will do my best to do them all. Alright, but how do I... Quest right here. Oh, do I just do it from here? Hand it over? Okay, oh, I'm done. Perfect. Everyone's allied. That's for completing a quest, I guess. Dude, side quest. I'm down. I will do as many of these side quests as I can. 
Potentially all of them. Alright, so where do I find... Are there any other side quests I can do? How are you feeling, cadet? If you're a volunteer soldier, never let your guard down in real battle. Sometimes there are strong others who actually eat OSF members, although you won't ever encounter major others like that. I mean, eventually I will. Alright, are there any other side quests I can do? This bulletin board! It's gotta mean something! That attack was really scary, but I became a huge fan of yours after watching your fight on the drone broadcast. Your number, you're my number two behind the Rashi. Oh, wow, okay. So, like... Are there any other side quests I can do? Generally, this Scarlet... Yeah, I already talked to you. I know your dialogue, like the back of my hand. Any other side quests I can do? Is there like a side quest marker? Yo, Tri King, welcome. Thank you for the birthday wishes. Greatly appreciate it. Let's go to Sumeragi Tomb Grounds. There's an item over there. Is there like no marker to tell? Is there like no marker to tell where side quests are? That'd be really neat to have. Maybe there are no other side quests. Alright, I'm assuming these side quests aren't missable then. Ah, well, we'll figure it out. I did a little research if I, I already talked to you. Give me this item. Force Field MK1. I still have to learn how to... I have to type my download code in after stream today, but I have to learn how to get the downloadable content. Or not downloadable content, the pre-order bonus I got because I pre-ordered the game. So I have some stuff to get. Oh, that's the world map. We don't want that. Um, How do I go back? Seems very easy to get lost in this world map, in this uh, mini map. The mini map is uh, kind of mixed on it right now. At least, I don't know. It's a minor thing, but you see the marker like on the mini map. It's hard to tell which way is the arrow and which way is the back of it. The arrow doesn't look as pointy as normal. It's really hard to tell. It's a really minor thing to nitpick, though. Honestly, the game is like flawless so, so far, though. The game is like phenomenal. Uh, this is the world map again. Uh, alright. I guess there are no side quests. We're just gonna head to the construction site and do Mizuhagawa. Yeah, the Monster Hunter 2, the Monster Hunter Stories 2 demo is out today, apparently. And I, uh, still have to try that to see if I'll play it or not. I probably wouldn't play a day of release because I, I'd imagine this game, I'll probably be busy with this game and other Tales of games, so I might not play a day of release if it is good. I'll probably do what I did with Nocturne and have to, like, buy it but wait a bit to play it. If I do like it, assuming I like it, of course. Yuito, I sent you the location data for the distress signal. Confirm? Marishi should be there. Understood. Oh, hi there. Brain Crush. This is what the settings told me about. Attacks. Attack that destroys the enemy's weak point and defeats it in one hit. Chip down the enemy's crush gauge, locate, locate below its health gauge, and an icon will appear. When it does, press L2 to execute a brain crush. Ooh. This is kind of like a finisher. Could be reduced greatly with follow-up attacks and second follow-up attacks. Okay. I think I get it now. How do I do this brain crush thing? Oh! Oh, that's awesome. Love that. That was cool. Goodbye. That's awesome. Oh, by the way, uh, I forgot to say this a while back. Um, at the Square Enix presentation... 
they did announce that Final Fantasy Origin game. But they had a demo for it. I did try it out. That Brain Crush reminded me of something you could do in that game, which is why I'm bringing this up now. But I tried that Final Fantasy Origin game, and I just want to say, as a Final Fantasy fan, I'm probably not going to buy it. <laughs> it's not for me. I didn't really like what I saw. What's it like there? The extinction belt advanced while the city was being constructed. A lot of others came down, and it became a dangerous area. There are no plans to restart construction. It's a forgotten ghost town. By the way, uh, interrupting what I'm saying, look at this gorgeous landscape. This straight up is beautiful. Just, just look at this. The game isn't like FF7 Remake pretty, but like this is beaut- This game is beautiful. This art style is really nice. Like, this is a really nice- This graphical- Oh my god, it fell! <laughs> and the stairs. This looks like FF7 Remake, like the pizza in the sky, like the Sector 7 plate. This looks amazing. Like this obviously doesn't have the best graphics, but like the-, the What they did, they have a unique art style. I really like the art style. It's a beautiful game. What system is this demo on? Oh, the Final Fantasy thing. It's on PS4, PS5. I think Xbox. It's definitely on PS4 and PS5. But yeah, it wasn't... Anyway, as I was saying, it wasn't a... It's kind of like a Dark Souls kind of cross thing. Not because I don't, I don't like Dark Souls games. I'm not really a fan of the Souls series. I tried Bloodborne and played like two hours and I was like, yeah, this isn't for me. But, um, that's not really the only reason. I just didn't really like what I saw. Mostly, probably because I didn't like Dark Souls. Who knows? But, um, I was like, you know what? A Final Fantasy game, a reboot of the original could be interesting. But I didn't really like what I played. So I was like, eh, I'll pass playing actual, like, good Final Fantasy games. Also, it seemed a little too edgy for me. Like, I don't mind the games being dark. I play Berseria. Berseria is, like, in my top 10 games. So, Berseria is great. But, um, it seemed a little too edgy just for the sake of being edgy, which I wasn't a fan of. You know, the whole Kill Chaos thing. I'm sure it's a meme now. They made that into a meme, but, you know. Oh, battles. Where's the... Oh, hey, hey, guys. Also, I don't have Hinab... Hinaba, Hanabi, Hanabi. I, I forgot her name already. But um, I don't have Hanabi, so I can't do my pyrokinesis, which kind of blows, but you know, it'd be that way. I want my brain crush. Oh, I can't get my brain crush. Rip. Never mind, you do level up from battle. Do I have any more SP to use? That'd be nice. For my brain map. Oh, we got some BP. Nice. Um, give me, I really want, ooh, that's nice. That takes three BP, but that's really neat. I'm a fan of aerial combat. I do want this because I feel like I mastered the perfect dodge a decent amount. Perfect dodge attack. You can like just chain, kind of like Persona 5 Strikers, again, to compare it to something. Oh, double jump? I'm in. <laughs> it's a must. You know, I'm a big fan of this brain map. Oh, hey. Hey, uh, Sabat. I'm gonna call you Bicorn because you look like Bicorn from Persona. Weak point protected by shells. Some others have a hard shell. I can't believe- I, I still can't believe they're called others. Like, could they not think of a better name for these enemies? Some others have a hard shell that protects their weak points. If you come across an other like this, you'll have to break its shell to reveal its weak point in order to defeat it. Attacking their weak spots will greatly reduce their crush gauge. Okay, kind of like staggering in FF7 Remake and pressuring. Time to go. Ow. So doing a double jump is nice. Not sure how much I'll utilize it, but hey, aerial combat. Ow. I need, I need healing. Where, where is your weak point, though? Yo, what if there's a skill? Oh, there it is. Get it. Pressure on. Time to go. I will destroy you with all my power. I need to dodge. Oh, easy dodge. That's a good way to chain combos. Ow! How dare you? I can still fight. I can still fight, by the way. By the way, um, I still recognize Yuito's voice. Do you think 
It's someone I should know, but I can't really think. Come on, dodge. There we go. Go down! Oh, goodbye. Time for the rising slash. Alright, not bad, not bad. Dude, this combat is so fun. It takes some time to get used to. It takes a lot to get used to, but it's really fun. Big, big, big fan. Honestly, this is a candidate for, like, my, like... Probably, I can't say my favorite game overall. Like, in my top... I can't say top 10 yet. I haven't even finished the game with the story. But combat-wise, this is, like, probably one of my favorite combats. I could say enough for the combat, and I can imagine the combat's gonna get better. So, like, I can speak enough... I feel like I've played enough of the game to say this combat style is one of my favorites. If only for combat alone. Right now. And my expectations were pretty high. Like, I was expecting a decently fun combat. Even so, I avoided as much spoilers and videos and reviews on this game as I could. And, like, I'm being blown away now. And I'm glad I didn't play the demo. Part of me is, like, I think, I, I think I'm glad I didn't touch the demo. So now I'm, like, experiencing all this at the first, first playthrough and all. You gotta find a way to go. Dude, this straight up looks like the Sector 7 plate. I'm just saying. This is going back to the entrance. This is wrong. Oh, this music's great too. The music is also really unique and phenomenal so far. Alley-oop! Where, where am I going? There's gotta be somewhere I can go. Any other enemies? Oh, well, thank you for blocking me off. I guess I can find the way easier now. Ba -ba -bum. Can't believe I have to stop playing this gorgeous game in like probably about an hour, give or take. However long we're gonna go. I did say I wasn't gonna stream for too long because uh, I have a. Uh, my family wanted to do something for my birthday. Plus, I have to edit these videos and bring them to YouTube. Like, if I stream for too long and I go out for dinner or something, it's gonna be hard. I have to, like, edit the videos to make sure that people on YouTube can watch these tomorrow. So, you know. There's also that as a factor. I haven't saved in a while, and we'll also shop because we should have a good amount of money. Give me this. All the materials are mine. Yeah, I see it. Don't worry, don't worry. Like, if it wasn't my birthday, I'd be down for streaming for five hours and I go out and I go out with my family for dinner, like, late, like, after that. Because I can be up, you know, if I didn't really, if it was my birthday, I wouldn't be in a rush. To get these videos edited, but it's because of that that I kind of have to manage my time a bit. As much as I want to play Scarlet Nexus for five hours, I don't think I could. It's fine, because the next stream, which will probably be Sunday, we will play for at least four to five. Uh, I want some light jellies. Uh, what's this? Recovers gauge to full. Battle records. Data acquired from battling an other. It's a very real value. I don't get what that means. I already have some apparently though. No new weapons to buy. This is oil. Oil kind of blows, so buying oil resistant stuff is pretty neat. Also, I'm a, I'm a fan of the camp menu too. The camp menu looks neat. Oh, I have to add more slots to my plugins. I get it. Because I only have one plugin. Can I add that right? I don't have any BP. I can't. Yeah, alright. We'll, we'll do that later. <laughs> 